Hello everybody, it's Avalon and I am on my way to the post office to mail out the Kratom to the contest winner. And um, I just wanted to pop on real quick and let you know that my Bernie is off of work because he's a bus driver. He drives people to um, mentally challenged people to, day, to their day programs. And with this whole thing going on, um, he's not driving. So he's home, which makes it harder for me to do my videos and to get some alone time, which I really love my alone time. Uh, so I probably won't be making as many videos as, as I should be. But uh, today I wanted to talk to you about um, be getting sober, getting clean on your own. Now, for me, I couldn't have done that because I was like so deep and I, I had to like, it, I went away for a year, six months, a year and eight months and I had to get my, like, I had to change my my whole life. I had to change, learn how to live life over. And, and so, you know, I've, I meet a lot of people, I talk to a lot of people who get clean and then think that they can just live their, live a normal life and go, go back to the, you know, to the way it was or, or whatever without doing recovery without doing something for their recovery, whether it's meetings, whether it's a sponsor, whether it's um, drug and alcohol counseling, whether, no, it's something. Because, and, and, I, and I get, I wonder how long a person can keep that up. Because when you're a real addict, that beast that lives inside well, it's constantly on your back. And it needs to be fought. It needs to be fought with recovery of some sort. Because you can't do it on your own. You may be able to do it on your own for a little while. White knuckling it. I did that for two years. Even though I was going to meetings, even though I was doing all the right things, I needed some help. My help came with Suboxone and then Kratom. And so I continued the Kratom. That seems to work better for me. But does it take away all my, all my cravings and my desires to use? Nope. Um, the last couple days, I've been craving big time. I have been daydream, you know, like drifting off and daydreaming about shooting up. I've been having using dreams. I just have this feeling that I just, you know, I want to use. And, and I'm, I'm over five years out and it still happens to me because it's something, so, because it's something I'm going to have to fight for the rest of my life. Sometimes they're easier than others. Sometimes are harder. And what's important to me is that I up my recovery during these times. I'm not beyond a relapse, guys. I'm not beyond it. I'm, I don't think that I got this. I never will have this. And so I need to up my recovery and put up my defenses. So I, uh, you know, I wanted to come on and talk to you guys about that because I don't know how somebody can get clean and sober and do nothing for their recovery because I know I can't and, you know, every day I have to fight this. Every day I have to go at, come at my addiction and put up my defenses and fight this. Whether it's meditation, whether it's um, 
reading my reading the big book, whether it's talking with another addict, um, whether it, it, it's something uplifting and encouraging others helps me to encourage myself. And so, you know, I, I, it's important, guys. You, 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 the stresses of life will always be there, and you don't want to be in a in a weakened state. And because it's so dangerous, and um, it, a relapse can happen before you even realize it's happened. So, and it will come in, and it will tell you just one more time to relieve the stress, or you know, because that's what I fell for so many times. All right, well, I got to go into the post office, and I'm not going to be doing any Kratom giveaways going forward for a while because I don't, I don't know that the post offices won't be closing, and I don't want to deal with all that. So I will wait a little while till this kind of blows over, and start the the Kratom contests back up. Appreciate you guys. I hope you guys are having a good day. Brightest blessings and God is bless. Well, if I can shut this off. <laughs>